Why you guys about to react to the video? Trump's VP says we need to investigate the Biden administration. Check this out. And the entire Biden crime family. Senator, if former President Trump were to win, if you were to be his vice president, would you support him appointing a special prosecutor to go after his political enemies, the Bidens? Well, first of all, Kristen, I find it interesting how much the media and the Democrats have lost their mind over this particular quote. Donald Trump is talking about appointing a special prosecutor to investigate uh, Joe Biden for wrongdoing. Joe Biden has done exactly that for the last few years and has done far more in addition to that to engage in a campaign of lawfare against his political opposition. I think what Donald Trump is simply saying is we ought to investigate the prior administration. There are obviously many instances of wrongdoing. Uh, the House Oversight Committee has identified an, a number of corrupt business transactions that may or may not be criminal. Of course, you have to investigate to find out. So I think Donald Trump saying, look, let's do the basic work of investigating wrongdoing is a totally reasonable thing for him to do. And frankly, the Biden administration has done far worse. So if you think that what Donald Trump is proposing is a threat to democracy, isn't what Biden has has already done a massive threat to our Se system of law and government. Senator, just to be very clear, though, Joe Biden didn't appoint a special prosecutor. The attorney general did that. Trump was indicted by grand juries. He was found guilty by a jury of his peers in New York. But can we just go back to the core question here? Would you support him taking such an action? It sounds like you're saying, yes, you would. I would absolutely support investigating prior wrongdoing by our government. Absolutely, that's what you have to have in a system of law and order, Kristen. But I have to reject the premise here. Uh, Joe Biden appointed the Attorney General Merrick Garland, who, of course, answers to Joe Biden, can be fired by Joe Biden. So the idea that the Biden administration has nothing to do with the appointment of the special prosecutor, I think, completely betrays an understanding, a misunderstanding of how but, our system of government actually but, works. But there's, and of but, course, and of course, Kristen, we we ha, we we have to say, we have to make this point, Kristen, uh, that the prosecution of Donald Trump in New York, which I think now is fundamentally been thrown in doubt by this immunity case, it was one of the main guys was a Department of Justice official in the Biden administration who jumped ship to join a local prosecutor's office to go after Donald Trump. And yet Trump. the DOJ that told Congress, doesn't make you question Senator, the legitimacy of the prosecution, that's a problem. Well, Senator, that happens all the time. People are appointed from Washington. But the DOJ told Congress, testified this week Kristen, that it reviewed it happens, all... It, hold on, Senator, Are let you me really finish. saying, Kristen, Senator, Senator, it, Senator, happens, let me finish my it happens sentence, all the time? Then I'll let you finish. Hold on. The number let, let me just please. finish this. The go DOJ ahead. told Sorry. Congress this week it reviewed all communications since Biden took office and found no contact between federal prosecutors and those involved with that case in New York. Can you stick to the substance of the question, though? Let me just ask, because you are, I just want to stick with. Wow, guys, she didn't hear the answer that she wanted to hear, so she tried to ask him, would you stick to the premises of the question? He already said, yes, he would support going after Biden. I don't know who wouldn't go after Biden after he did what he did. He sent all types of obstacles at Trump, and Trump just got through him. And let me know what you guys think about this new VP of Trump's. I haven't heard much about him, so I'm going to do more research to learn where our country is headed. And do you guys think that was a good pick? Let me know what you guys think about this video. Be sure to like, comment, subscribe if you're new. And as always, let me know what to react to. We're out.